So in this video, I'm going to show you how you go from an app sketch, you can see here on the left-hand side, to a prototype, as you see on the right, that actually looks like it might be running on iOS on uh, an Apple device. And so we're going to be using the actual design elements from Apple to piece this together. You should have this keynote downloaded to your computer from one of the previous classes that we had together. So this is the Apple Design Resources keynote and it has a whole bunch of different elements that are actually how things appear on the device. And so you're gonna be able to use these to piece together a prototype for your app from the sketch. Let's get started with putting together that prototype. So the way I'm gonna start is I'm actually gonna take my prototype sketch and I'm going to search through the keynote materials to try to find the pieces that I think might be useful for this task. Okay, so that's looking pretty good. You'll notice that I actually took all of the slides themselves and copied them into my prototype keynote. The reason I do that is because I don't want to edit the original set of slides that, that have everything perfect. And now I know that everything is within this file that I can then use as I piece together my prototype. So I look at this and I see that I have a tab bar at the bottom. I have kind of a title here, a couple of rows of a table like this, and then a separate part where I have, again, rows in the table, but these are completed, and so I want to show them in a slightly different way. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take a device. I'm going to get this phone out of here. So I'm going to edit the master, so you can see I have this blue bar at the bottom. And this is that device frame. And I'm gonna take both the frame and the white space behind it, and um, I'm gonna just copy those out. So I'm gonna hit done, I'm gonna go back to my prototype, and now I can see I have those very nicely there. And I'm gonna resize it a bit. And I don't really need this, so I'll just, I'll just delete it for now. Let's now do the taskbar at the bottom. Now you'll see that it goes outside of the frame. I'm going to change the order so that it's actually behind the frame. So now it looks like that tab bar is inside, uh, running inside my app. I only need four tabs, so I'm gonna delete one of them. Uh, to do that, I'm going to ungroup these. And so Keynote also lets you play with distances between things really nicely. And so now we can take all four of those, move them around. And there's a nice little tab bar at the bottom. And now I can get it to say the thing that I want it to say for each one. All of these are just grouped text boxes. And so you can adjust them by opening them up. It's because this one is highlighted and I wanna show, it's actually the task screen that I'm doing. I'm gonna switch this and that. So that's my taskbar. Okay, looking sharp. And it doesn't bother me too much that I put the text in my sketch here and the icons below. Uh, I kind of like this. I like the way it looks, so I'm gonna leave it, leave it that way. Okay, so that part is done. Let's talk about the title up here now, Today's App Development Tasks.
And now let's try to get some of those tables in there to show what those would look like. And so now that I have that the way I want it, I can just copy it and change it so it matches my prototype. Okay, and so looking at this, you can see that I've kind of related the two. It's looking pretty good. And now I am ready to potentially build a series of these screens. You don't have to fill in everything. It's the essential features to communicate what your idea is to someone who might be interested in it. So now it's your turn. Use the keynote prototype and build your own series of screens for what you have in mind for this project. Good luck.